In the vast tapestry of human history, there are countless tales that weave together to form the intricate picture of our collective past. Today, we delve into one such tale, a tale that is not only a testament to the human spirit, but also a stark reminder of the perils of silence and the transformative power of speaking out. Imagine a small town nestled in the heart of an oppressive regime. A town whose heart beats with the rhythm of fear and oppression. A place where the air is thick with unspoken words and stifled cries for freedom. This is the town of Freeton. In Freeton lived a humble tailor, Elias. He was an ordinary man with an extraordinary spirit. Elias was known for his beautiful tapestries, but his true masterpiece was his voice. A voice that dared to echo the unspoken words of his townsmen. Elias understood the power of his voice. He understood that while the needle and thread gave life to his tapestries, his voice could breathe life into the spirit of his town. He knew that silence was not just the absence of noise, but the absence of justice, of freedom, of life itself. One day, Elias decided to challenge the silence. He started to speak out against the oppressive regime, using his words as threads to weave a tapestry of resistance. He spoke of freedom, of justice, of a future where the people of Freeton were not bound by fear. The regime, threatened by Elias's voice, tried to silence him. But Elias's words had already taken root in the hearts of the townspeople. They began to speak out, their voices joining Elias's in a symphony of resistance. The regime tried to quell the growing dissent, but the voices of Freeton could not be silenced. The once oppressed town, now emboldened by the power of their collective voice, rose against their oppressors. The regime crumbled and Freeton was finally free. The story of Elias and the town of Freeton serves as a poignant reminder of the dangers of silence and the transformative power of speaking out. It illustrates how silence can perpetuate oppression, allowing it to fester and grow. On the other hand, speaking out can spark change, igniting a flame of resistance that can topple even the most oppressive regimes. The tale of Freeton also emphasizes the importance of each individual voice. Elias was just a humble tailor, but his voice was the catalyst for monumental change. This underlines the fact that every voice matters and that each one of us has the power to make a difference. In conclusion, silence can be a form of oppression, one that stifles voices and allows injustice to prevail. However, by speaking out, we can challenge this silence, using our voices as powerful tools for change. The story of Freeton is not just a tale of resistance, but a testament to the power of the spoken word. So remember the tale of Freeton, remember Elias, and remember your voice is your power. Use it wisely, use it bravely, use it for change. For it is through our voices that we write the history of tomorrow.